Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. The neighbors are next door sanding their deck. I'm sure you can hear it. They've been doing it all morning. So uh, you're just gonna hear it in the background. They're actually doing a really good job. I think it's gonna turn out really cool. But the reason we're out here, besides the fact that the dogs are out here, is we have to do baby bird checkup. Go see, you wanna go show everybody? Let's go see if there's baby birds yet. I keep hearing chirping over here. So I think there's a bird's nest over there. So far I haven't heard anything back here. So I don't think we have baby birds just yet. What do you think, Miss Kira? We got baby birds back here yet? Is she on the nest? If she's on the nest, I'm just gonna leave her alone. She... Well, I was gonna leave you alone, lady. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I don't think there's baby birds just yet. I think still just eggs, but because she's right there, we're gonna leave her alone and maybe we'll check back later. I have a feeling if there was baby birds, we would probably hear them yelling when she leaves like that, and I don't want to bother her more than necessary, so I don't really want to peek in there. Maybe I'll get JB to do it for us later, but again, I don't want to bother her because I don't want her to like abandon the babies or anything even though they're just eggs right now. And hopefully that fence is gonna work. The dogs don't seem to be as interested back there anymore, so hopefully that's gonna work. What do you think, girls? It's nice and cool today. You wanna go for a ride? Whoa. Wanna go for a ride in a Jeep? Hey, wanna go for a ride? Wanna go on an adventure? Let's go. <laughs> they're like, okay, let's go. But before we go for a ride, we got a box. The next portion of today's video is sponsored by our amazing friends at HelloFresh. So now we're gonna open up this box and we're gonna see what's inside. If you guys are interested in getting your own HelloFresh box, you can go to hellofresh.com and use the code SNOWDOGSVLOGS16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. Let's see what we got in the box. In case you guys don't know, HelloFresh actually delivers fresh quality produce from the farm to your door in less than a week. So you can enjoy these summer flavors right at home. These are the meals that we got in the box. This week we got, oh, this might be what we have to make when we get back from our drive. That looks really good. <gasps> Chili ginger pork. I always forget what I say I want in these things. <laughs> so it's always a surprise to me. Ooh. Oh man, I don't know. That looks really good. I think it's gonna be this. I'll have to ask Jamie, but I think it's gonna be that. So now that we have the menu cards out, let's look inside. So everything comes nicely packaged in each little bag for whichever meal you're making. Hi, sweetheart. And of course, recyclable, all of that good stuff. We always recycle our cardboard boxes. And don't forget, under the ice, there's all the meat. So something else I thought was really cool, and we almost did this with our last box, was you can actually change your delivery address. So like if you're going to be on vacation, if you're staying at a cabin or something, you can have the food delivered to where you are, and then you can change your address back to your home address. So I thought, I thought that was kind of unique and different. We almost did that the last time we went on a little vacation. I'm like, maybe we should have it delivered, then we don't have to think about what to make. <laughs> So this is the bag that corresponds with the meal I believe we are going to make today. And then of course the chicken was underneath the ice. So all of the things listed on here will be in this bag. And then on each of these cards, it kind of gives you a little bit of more information and tells you what you need to make this meal. And of course, super easy instructions. All right, so we're gonna load these girls up and take them for an R-I-D-E. And then when we get back, we'll make some food. Eleanor's like, oh wait, wait, we're going dad. <laughs> Memphis. Since when are you shedding? Hi, pupper! Are you going for a ride in a Jeep? Huh, are you going for a ride? Oh my gosh, guys, this is so, hi! How are you? I told you he's going for a ride, I wasn't lying. We really is, we's in the car, we're going for a drive. It's so nice outside and it's not hot. We did leave the top part up, we have the windows in the back out, but we left the top part up because uh, when the sun comes out, it can get a little warm. But we stopped at the gas station to grab road trip snacks. We're not really road tripping, we're just going for a drive, but you know, gotta get some road trip snacks. Are you happy, Kira? Oh, look, there's a Memphis. Memphis, you gonna get some trees? Well, here they come. Yes, good job, Memphis. This is like, oh, Eleanor, are you gonna try? No, 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 no. Memphis is like, I'm gonna, oh, there's a butterfly. I got distracted. <laughs> See them trees? Get them. Get 
Ge dem mal fest. Ge dem mal fest. Ge oh, ge oh, almost had it. <laughs> Whoa, here they come. She's like, mm, yeah. Gotta be the poke. The watch out, those are pokey. Okay, here you go. Yes! Good job! Yes, good job! <laughs> And yes, Eleanor's got her head out too, but she's over there. She's not biting at trees just yet. She's like, I'm thinking about it, but nah, nah. <laughs> so we came out on, I never remember the name of this road, Elk John Bay area. Yeah. And I showed you guys my lilies the other day that opened. We're trying to figure out if this is the same flower or not. It really looks like the same flower, but we noticed they're all over on the side of the road. It's gotta be the same, hon. Hey, what do you think? Is that the same flower we have out front? Is that, are you looking for a deer? I don't see any deer, sorry. Maybe we'll go find you some cows. <laughs> <laughs> but there's a bunch of different little wild floweries out here, but. Still too early for blueberries. Still too early for blueberries, but could be wild raspberries, raspberries. and saskatoons. Okay. That's the other thing that's coming into season right now, What's saskatoons. I don't know. I just saw the girl on the internet post about it. <laughs> what? Oh, did we stop moving? Oh, sorry. Okay, Keep we'll on. stop. We'll start moving again. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we were just trying to figure out if those were the same flowers that we have at our house. Yeah. We found an off-road trail. Hey, you get to test out your new tires. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Like, <laughs> here's like, oh yeah, give me close to them trees. Here's the water under the tire. She does. This is uh, one of the areas where we take the dogs sledding in the wintertime. It is. All right, Kira, here you go. This is like, give me the trees. Oh, the water. Yes, throw one in my pee. <laughs> so, she's so goofy. <laughs> the dogs are like, hey, can we get out? No, because some jerks use this as a dumping ground. This is where we found the raspberries last year. Yeah, I think I see wild strawberries too, but... No. Really? I smell citronella. I smell it, yeah. I don't see the raspberries. I see maybe some back here, but... Hey, you're fine. We're right here. And grasshoppers. I was going to say, they're all over, huh? I can see them from the car. Yeah, see right here? Yeah. This one's just little babies. Yep. I'll have to come back out here in a couple weeks. There's some more. All, yeah, all back in there. Those are all wild raspberries. Hmm. So we'll have to come back in a couple weeks. Yep, not ready yet. And see, yeah, look at that. That's what all of these are gonna be. Yep. There's so many! Holy cow! Yeah, we're stepping right over. Yep. Huh. Yeah. So as long as we get back here before anybody else discovers <laughs> it, we should be good. People come out here every once in a while and clean it up. We've been back out here before. This is, there's a... Civil War guy buried back there, but you can see. Oh, we drove right over this too. Yeah. Scary. Yeah, we did it last time too. But, but they just come out here and throw garbage. Yeah, I remember when Mark and I, uh, when we worked at Young's, every once in a while we'd see a fridge or uh, something, you know, dumped on the side of the road, and we'd grab it and throw it in the truck. Cause, I mean, right. Right. You guys picked it up. Yeah. Because, yeah, we picked it up. Because people. Just do this, but. Yeah, but I don't have any place to put this no. stuff. No, maybe we'll have to come back out here and clean some of this up with trailer. gloves and not dogs. Yeah, in the trailer, because <laughs> that's just ridiculous. Like, just take care of your trash, people. Yeah, William Barney is buried back there. We're not going back there today, though. I guess we could, but. What do you think, Miss Elnor? <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> She's like, I haven't learned the whole biting the trees thing yet. Hi. But this ride's pretty good. <laughs> Hi, Kira. Hi, <laughs> Memphis. All right, back in the Jeep. The campground back here by the river, which we've stayed at a few times, but we're noticing, look, there's red paint on those trees, and there's yellow paint on these trees. The campground's over this way. Man, I really hope they don't cut these trees hmm. down. I mean, they usually don't paint them unless they disappear. But maybe that's the stop line. But even at that, why would they clear cut all of this? Like uh, maybe maybe cutting. those because they were close to the road. Because yeah, I didn't see that they went deeper, and I don't see. Yeah, I don't see them now either. A whole bunch more here either. So, so maybe the campground will be saved. <laughs> we could bring mom and dad back here to go camping. Yeah, absolutely. We'll kayak down the since, river back here. Since nobody's here, we'll go look at the river real quick. Yeah. So this is Thunder Bay River, right? Yes. Yeah, Thunder Bay River. Yep. 
Ooh, it's really low. I was wow. just gonna say, holy cow. It is well, I low. Could, I could drive right to the Let's not. edge of it, but I think you would not be happy. Yeah, I, so. I would not be happy. <laughs> you would not, not be happy. See, I could probably turn around in the middle of the water, but I'm not going to do yeah, that. No, let's not do that. Bugs. Bugs! So, all the campsites are down this way, and there's a neat little trail you can walk. But pretty much every single campsite butts up to the water. It has a little path down to the down to the river there. Yep. There's some nice big sites back here. We've camped back here a few different times. There's no power or any of that stuff back here, but nope. there's some nice sites. See, you can get right down to the river. Yep. There's the water pump. These flowers. Trying to figure out if those orange flowers are the same as these flowers. I think they could be, but I'm not 100% sure. Was that a super fun ride? Are you ready for your lunch? Yeah. Say, all right, we chilled out for 15 minutes after we got home. Kira, are you hugging your bowl? Because you're like, Mom, could you just please put food in here? All right, I'm going to feed these puppers. Say, uh, yeah, I would like some food. And then i got to make food for Jamie and I. You all look so happy. You're like, we're so happy. We went for a ride and it was great. Decision has been made. We're making this. All the stuff we need was right in a bag, plus the chicken that's still in the fridge. It says a green pepper, but this green pepper is a little bit red. Doesn't matter. It'll still taste amazing. Got my two little kitchen helpers in here waiting for anything to hit the floor. Just cut up the potatoes and getting ready to put those in. Made the sauce. Kira's hanging out on her bean bag chair. That's the sauce. Got all the stuff cut up. We're just gonna continue on. Cooking up the chicken, smells good. I got the buns in the oven getting toasted. And of course, the dog in the way. And the other dog in the way. <laughs> well, it looks delicious. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna turn your plate here. <laughs> Potatoes look delicious. They smell good too. Now it's time for taste test. <laughs> all right, moment of truth. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah? Yeah, put that on the list. That's really good. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's just chickens and onions and a They're green pepper, <laughs> green red pepper, and mayo and sour cream and garlic, and you know, all the stuff that was on the list. Mm -hmm. Good. <laughs> good. I'll put it on the list. We'll get this one again. Mm -hmm. So dinner was amazing. It was super easy to make. And again, you guys, thank you to our friends at HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. Link's down in the video description below. You can go to HelloFresh.com and use the code SNOWDOGSVLOGS16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. That was pretty good. Now I have no idea what else we're doing today, but uh, that was good food. <laughs> Ma'am, I said you needed to go outside <laughs> and you jumped up there to hide and snuggle. Maybe. Would you like to go outside with your sisters? Come on. She's gonna get you. Come on. She's gonna get you. <laughs> but look at her face of like, don't you dare me. Don't you dare make me move. You sure you don't wanna go outside? Go outside? Come She's on. gonna push you outside. Let's go. Outside. I try to push your butt. Come on. I push your butt. Uh, uh, uh. Come on, let's go. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> I feel like it's a trap. <laughs> right? You look frozen. Are you going? Boop. I'm go outside. I don't want to. I was just out there an hour ago. <laughs> Are you frozen? <sighs> Fine, you can stay here. Yeah. She's like, yes, I win. I get to snuggle spot. Yeah. <laughs> Memphis says no. She says she don't want to come out here with you guys. What do you think? I'm like, we don't care. We're just having fun out here anyway, right? Should we go check on the bird? <sighs> All right, I'm going to walk back there and see if we can see anything. So I know we checked on her this morning and she was on the eggs. I came out here a little bit ago and she wasn't on the eggs. So maybe she's not on them. So she's not on them, but she's up there. Yeah, I know. So I'm not gonna get any closer again. I wish I would have grabbed my camera earlier because we could have at least checked on the eggs. But again, no little baby chirping yet. So I don't think there's babies quite yet. Would you stop plucking the apples off the tree? <laughs> Look at it. They've gotten them all off of the bottom of this tree. Oh, there's some right there. They've been pulling them off the bottom of the tree. You and Eleanor both. Come on, let's leave the birdie alone. Come on, let's leave Mama Bird alone. So she can go back and lay on her eggs. Eventually we'll get some baby birds back here. Leave the apples alone! Also, check this out, you guys. Notice, Kira does not have her short leash on. We've been doing sometimes on, sometimes off. And she's actually been coming inside when we ask her to. Will she do it right now? I don't know. Let's find out. Hold on. Gotta get these mushrooms before the dogs eat them. Look at them. Okay. Let me pull these, mu Let me pull these mushrooms out first. And then we'll get Kira inside. 
See how little those were? Yeah, I look for these every day. Multiple times a day so nobody eats them. All right, ready, Kira? No, we just picked all those mushrooms. We just picked them all out of there. We're not eating them. Okay, come on, let's go. Come on, inside, let's go. Come on, you can do it. Uh, I, as you say, you're gonna make a, you're gonna show everybody that you can't do it, even though I just said you could. Come on, let's go inside. Go, come on. Good job, go. Go on. Sometimes I just kinda gotta get behind her, remind her that the door is that way. Go on, come on, let's go. Come on, Kira, let's go. No, now she's gonna look for the mushrooms I just picked. <laughs> All right, we'll try again in a minute. Five minutes later. Look, she's at the door. Come on. Come on, I don't... <sighs> you were doing so good. Now you're not. The minute I try to show everybody that you learn how to listen, you decide not to listen. Doesn't surprise me. Look, I got her inside. She really did do it all by herself. Believe it or not, I just had to coax her. <laughs> What, what, were you, what was your sister doing out there? What were you doing out there? Were you catching bugs in midair? <laughs> it wasn't fast enough to catch you. She was catching bugs. We are gonna go ahead and call it a night. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video as always. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Say goodnight, audience. Ready? Three, two, one.